So what? I was just recording over there. I was just recording the traffic because I was talking to a guy here earlier. Okay. The traffic for ambience. So this is a radio program. I was talking to uh, the guy right down there, and there were guys driving by honking. So I thought, like that. So I thought I'd better get some honking ambience. It's just for radio work. But um, it looked like you were pulling the thing. I was. Do you want to hear it? No, I don't. It's just the sound, and then you guys yelling at me. Yeah, same. <laughs> push it that way and listen to it. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So who are those guys? Heading out. You know, I just got here. I'm from Utah. I'm driving across the country. Where you park at? Right over there. <laughs> I'm with the police. Well, I parked. Kind of picked a side. Bit. You kind of picked a side. Yeah, that's, that's, you know what I'm saying? That's why I asked you. You kind of picked a side. Right. You know? They, so, what radio station are you with? This American Life. Uh, this American Life? Yeah, have you heard of that? Mm -mm. Um, has anybody, hey, has anybody on my stream from Utah heard of This American Life? You guys or me? I work for them. Uh, I'm talking to uh, about 500 people watching uh, you right now. Uh, how, so, it's a live stream? Yeah. Um, so, I'm on the. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> that bad for Would you like to say something? Heard, I bet somebody's heard of This American Life. Are they talking back? Uh, yeah, they're also having their own conversations. <laughs> oh, okay, wait. Awesome, This American Life. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, wait. You have to be vetted first. Show. No, you got to be vetted. I'm just saying, if you want to come over here and interview people, being over there is probably not the best idea for you. Exactly. I was over here earlier. Really it doesn't matter because nobody is a token representative of the entire black community or the protest. You know what I mean? Like we're just saying in general. Anything on that side of the street, you're not going to get a, a warm reception if you're trying to come over All right. here. You know I, didn't, I didn't and know just, that. I just got here like a couple hours ago. Yeah. People are saying that they are an Ameri a great radio show. I mean, it's that's all popular. I know from with? what they said. It's a program called This American Life. This I'm American talking. Life? Yeah. AM? No, it's FM. Usually it's a public radio program. Okay. Oh, okay. Like NPR or, yeah, or KPFA. Sure. Oh, okay. Sure. Not technically NPR, but yeah, Like Coast Coast, like Jordan Orient. I back up off you yeah, a little bit. Oh yeah, now we we occupy mainstream media. I will shut down your live broadcast. I'll just come stand right in your mic. Fuck, bitch! I don't give a fuck, lying ass bitch. Shut that down. You can't even be here. None of that. I'm like, cause you can't put that on TV. So go away. <laughs> it's on NPR here in St. Louis. Oh, okay. So. uh it's on the uh, National Public Radio in St. Louis. It's one of their programs is This American Life. Right. Can I ask you that question? Did you ask me that question? Yeah, yeah. I have to, I have to turn this back on. Is that all right? <laughs> turn it back on now. Yeah. I'm behind the camera. Look up. Sorry, baby. I just know. I know. All right, yeah, no, it's a, it's public, it's public community radio. Um, what is it? Well, it used to be like an NPR program, but now they distribute their own work. It's complicated, but it's basically like NPR, National Public Radio. You can type. I'm like, I'm streaming, I can't type anything. Is that a Zoom? <laughs> no. No? It's a, it's a stereo mic. Okay. And that's a, oh, a Zoom recorder. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, this is a Sony. I have a lot of public radio people on here. They're asking what kind of equipment you're using. <laughs> Ask them if they know, if they've heard of. Uh, I'm like, they can hear you. <laughs> Uh, Bruce O is giving me pretty much all he's going to, so. The question is, uh, yes, the ball down. Um, yeah, yeah. Religious affiliated? No, but that's part of, that's kind of what I'm, 
this strange about it. Because I think that America's divided between religious people and scientific people. And that they have different answers. Well, the question is, is you're saying, is this the end of the world? I just don't want to go to the I don't think it is. But from a spiritual standpoint, I can understand how that can be reasoned with, how, how that can be understood. Right. But from my personal opinion, I don't think it is. I think it, I, really, I think this is a rebirth. This is a, a, an awakening. So, it's going far as saying that is this the end of the world? I don't think it is. So you're more scientific okay. than you the big sounding ones too. You don't think that's important in this question? I mean, I, I don't think it's important because, I mean, you, my belief system doesn't make it, this is not going to change the situation. It's not going to change anybody's um, opinion because my, my opinions are just my opinion. So I'm unbiased right now. So. Well, can you tell me what's going on here tonight? I just running, basically like, got here a couple hours ago. <laughs> and like, well, yeah, right now, around. this is a rallying yeah. point yeah. for like right there, the peaceful protesters. Um, <laughs> not here on any malicious um, wow. attempts or anything like that. It's just all peaceful people just coming together, sharing information, um, having a dialogue, and just building relationships with each other. The guy at the library, he said his wife, the librarian, got arrested last night. She was drug out in the street. It was a protest last night? Not yeah, it was, a, it was a protest last night, but as far as a librarian being dragged down into the streets, I don't, I highly doubt that. Because nobody here is, nobody here is violent like that, so. Who drives the librarian into the street? I think that's a bit of an embellishment. The police? Huh. The, the police are the only ones dragging people into the street last night. There's hours, hours of live footage. She got arrested. Then there had to be the police. <laughs> Nobody's making citizens arrest. Yeah, there were two women. I don't know which one was a librarian, but one of them was. Uh, I don't know if dragged is the word I would use, but yanked really hard when she was obviously complying. Uh, yeah. like continuously yanked very hard yeah. and then well, taken behind a van so that we could no longer cover. Huh. Do you have it on video? Yeah. Her husband was wondering if it was on video. Uh, yeah, it's on video. Uh, Bella Echo or Argus News or Anon Ops Pro or Revolutionary Z. Um, every single one of those live streamers had that. Um, and it's all probably under the hashtag Ferguson on Twitter. So... There's like four or five live streams going out right now. Uh, those are just the people that like I know. Huh. And how many people are watching? Um, All around the world. On any given day. I mean, typically I'll have about four or five hundred uh, people viewing live right away, but then I'll also be mirrored on several different stream, other streams, and they'll have another, I don't know, anywhere between 700 and 1,000 people each on each, on their channels. And then um, the videos are uplight, uploaded and archived. So last night um, I got a little bit more than 5,000 views, and that's just on my page. I have no idea how many um, from the mirrored streams. Were you interviewed by the News Hour? No? no, I don't know. Uh, Probably not, because I tend to not talk to media. <laughs> I'm like, I can interview myself. <laughs> right. <laughs> All right. Well, thanks a lot. Thank you. I'm glad to be on your live stream. I feel like I should perform or something. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, thank you. All right, All right thank you. Well, I'm just going to record the traffic. Yeah, yeah, all right, cool. Yeah, from this side. Um, <laughs> awesome. <laughs> all right, so y'all know my style. When I see any form of media that I don't trust, I come film the whole fucking interview because you ain't sound biting my shit. What you doing? Um, but anyway, back to my break because I wasn't ready to come off break. That was just some random shit. So I'm gonna wait for the lag to drop and then I'm gonna shut down again. Y'all don't even know. I wish y'all could look at my fucking All I know is that I've only been streaming for